When Samantha Cariachi started getting intense pains in her back, stomach and legs, she thought she had just been working out a bit too hard. But it turned out, after a trip to air, that she had cysts on uterus and ovaries. A gym pods in the middle of the street The future of fitness Since having my youngest and last child my body has been a mess, she says. I've been getting ovarian cysts every 23 weeks and doctors can't tell me why. I've tried so many different birth controls and nothing is slowing them down. I've had my left ovary and both fallopian tubes removed, as well as my gallbladder that crapped out on me because of all the birth control I've tried. Chronic pain aside, having an oophorectomy is an incredibly difficult thing to come to terms with. A few weeks ago, she was told that she had a huge ovarian mass on her right ovary. A few weeks ago I found out I have a huge ovarian mass on my right ovary. I go to see a specialist about what it is and how to proceed with treatment. So fast forward to last night. Rob and I were supposed to have a date night but I ended up in the air in so much pain and spotting. They said the mass was still there and I really need to see a specialist. When we got home from the hospital I was crying and upset with my body. I felt like it was ugly, scarred, and completely broken. I felt like it has failed me. But Rob didn't see her that way. Rob said, come here babe, let me take your picture so I can show you the things I think are beautiful about your body. We sat and he proceeded to tell me all the wonderful things about my body. Ladies, that's the kind of man you deserve. A man that will pick you up when you're down, comfort you no matter what, endlessly tell you how perfect you are. More body positive blogger posts underwear selfie to show that even half-naked women deserve respect more thunder thighs is this summer's body positive anthem.